11 Herbs and Spices That Will Reduce Inflammation in Your Body Maritime Pine Bark Bark from the maritime pine tree can be processed into pycnogenol. This extract has been used for more than 2,000 years to help heal wounds, scurvy and ulcers as well as reducing vascular inflammation. It is one of the strongest antioxidants known today. Studies have shown that pycnogenol is 50 to 100 times more potent than vitamin E in neutralizing free radicals in the body. It has also been found to reduce blood pressure and the risk of blood clots. A typical dosage is 100 to 200 milligrams daily. Turmeric Turmeric contains a compound called curcumin, which is responsible for the vivid yellow color and has also been shown to be involved in many of turmeric's medicinal effects. Turmeric has a long history of use in both an Ayurvedic and Chinese traditional medicinal systems, where it is regarded as an excellent tonic and blood purifier and an effective remedy for inflammatory conditions such as arthritis, skin conditions including psoriasis, and digestive and liver disorders. Chili Peppers the countless varieties of hot peppers we have today began as one small shrub, also known as Capsicum anum, native to the tropical regions of the Americas. The chemical capsaicin is what makes the pepper hot, and it's capsaicin that's been shown to have an anti-inflammatory effect in your body. Any type of chili pepper, such as cayenne and jalapeno, contains capsaicin. You can use chili peppers fresh or powdered in a wide variety of dishes, including desserts. Supplements containing capsaicin are often mixed with other herbs to create natural anti-inflammatory blends. Green tea Green tea contains the highest level of polyphenols and is regarded as having the greatest therapeutic activity. Green tea polyphenols possess a potent antioxidant capacity that is far greater than that of vitamin C or E and may help in the prevention and treatment of numerous chronic diseases of our time. Studies of large populations of regular green tea drinkers report lower rates of some cancers and reduced risk of cardiovascular disease. White Willow Bark The bark of the white willow tree is believed to have been used as a herbal painkiller since at least the times of Hippocrates. Laboratory tests have demonstrated the anti-inflammatory and analgesic properties of its aspirin-like substances. Most clinical trials also support its role in relieving the pain of osteoarthritis. Frankincense The resin from the Boswellia tree has been used as Ayurvedic medicine for the treatment of inflammatory and rheumatic conditions for centuries. With a combination of anti-inflammatory, analgesic, and immune system modifying effects, it is particularly relevant for rheumatoid arthritis, an autoimmune form of arthritis that is both debilitating and difficult to treat. Black Pepper This unassuming spice actually packs an anti-inflammatory punch. The distinctive flavor of black pepper comes from the chemical piperin. Even at low doses, piperin has been shown to reduce inflammation. It can inhibit the spread of cancer and has been shown to suppress the perception of pain and arthritis symptoms. Clove Clove oil is a remarkably effective painkiller and anesthetic. When applied to toothache or inflamed gums, it reduces pain within minutes, although only for a relatively short time. It works by decreasing the affected tissue's perception of pain and also has anti-inflammatory and antibacterial properties. Ginger The humble spice ginger is also a potent medicine with impressive anti-inflammatory capabilities. Laboratory tests show that ginger inhibits a number of the compounds that promote inflammation in the body, including several of the enzymes that are targeted by pharmaceutical anti-arthritis medications. As a result, it provides relief from arthritis pain, and some studies have even found it to be as effective as the non-steroidal anti-inflammatory drug ibuprofen.
Cat's Claw Cat's Claw grows in tropical South and Central America and takes its name from the shape of the long thorns that help it to climb over other plants in the jungle. It has been used for hundreds of years by Peruvians to treat inflammatory conditions such as arthritis, asthma and skin problems and is also a traditional remedy for infections, fatigue and cancer. Laboratory studies attribute it with a number of immune-stimulating and anti-inflammatory properties which may be behind many traditional applications. Cinnamon This popular spice is made from the bark of cinnamon trees native to China, India and Southeast Asia. In addition to being anti-inflammatory, cinnamon has been shown to have antioxidant, anti-diabetic, antimicrobial, anti-cancer, and lipid-lowering properties. It has even been found to act against neurological disorders like Parkinson's and Alzheimer's diseases. Cinnamon goes well in anything from breakfast grains to soups and stews to desserts and drinks. Any pre-made apple pie or pumpkin pie spice mixes will often have cinnamon, cloves, and ginger all in one tasty blend. Thanks for watching and if you'd like to learn more about herbal remedies, check out the link in the description box below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this one.